Then we want to get through the anger as rapidly as possible. Because the longer you stay in anger, the more difficult your life is going to become. So I'm not suggesting, although I'm saying that anger is your guide to finding truth and finding love in the end, I'm not suggesting you stay in anger because you won't find truth and love that way. It's by using the anger as like a torch, showing your way into a deeper and darker place. Does that make sense? So the way I see anger is like holding a torch in your hand and you're walking along in a dark night and the torch is the only way you can see what's going on in front of you. And the way I see anger is very similar to that. that the anger is like a, a torch and the light being shown at what is dark inside of yourself. And that's why anger is your guide, because it helps you get into that place that's dark inside of yourself. If we stay in the anger, then what happens is that we will actually be in a place where we're living in the depths of darkness, but not actually doing anything with it. And we don't want to use our anger for that purpose. We want to use our anger as like a light shining on our real emotion that we want to deal with. Does that make sense to everyone?